everybody. Uh, so I'm up here at Expedition Fjord on Axel Hybrick Island in Nunavut, Canada. Uh, so I'm actually here investigating some questions about methane. Methane is, of course, a really important atmospheric gas on Earth. It's a greenhouse gas that contributes to global warming. And it also can tell us a lot about microorganisms deep in the subsurface. Methane has also been observed in the near surface atmosphere of Mars. Now, most methane on Earth is biogenic, meaning that it's produced by, by, by microorganisms or other life forms. And so the observations of methane on Mars uh, suggest that it could be a potential biosignature. There are a number of sources and sinks of methane here up in the Arctic um, in the active layer. Uh, so that's the layer, thin layer of ground that thaws during the summer that sits on top of the deep permafrost layer. There are microorganisms that both produce and consume methane. And so we're using this, this novel technology that we're working on co-developing with AB be incorporated in Quebec City uh, to better understand some of these methane cycles. Of course, we have the, the catabatic winds that come off the glaciers and they're quite cold. Um, we also have 24 hour sun, so it doesn't get any darker than it does now. Um, so this is sun just kind of goes around in the sky and it's a very different year. This is the first time we've had uh, any any connectivity. So we're using Starlink and um, it really changes the uh, it really changes the experience. 